Hello Collective, wherever you are. I hope your summer's safe, summer's warm, surrounded by love, light, happiness, joy, abundance, and filled with so much faith. Um, I'm going to be using the Eager Ellen Poe deck. It was my first deck I ever got. Um, that along with my, um, what do you call it, Oracle deck. Uh, I haven't used it on YouTube yet, so I figured I'd use it this time. The suits are a little bit different. Um, the ravens are cops, the wands are the eyes, and the pentacles are like graves. Um, uh, yeah, and the swords are hearts. So, yeah, um, I'm just going to refer to them as the traditional suits so that, you know, it doesn't get confusing to anybody. So, alright, now, um, so please hit the like button, please hit share, please hit subscribe, so you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there, and you can always be in tune. Um, if you would like to donate, you do not have to, it is not a requirement, but it is truly appreciated, and thank you from the bottom up with all my heart to anybody who chooses to do so, but again, it is not a requirement. Um, the information is in the description box down below, and thank you from the bottom up with all my heart ahead of time to anybody who chooses to do so, but again, it's not a requirement, even for the likes, the comments, the shares and subscribe so this is um we got the, the cherry at the bottom of the deck and we got the six of cups all right so you're moving forward all right and away from the past from people from your past six of cups the ravens are um cups okay you and i'm strongly getting somebody like not happy about this they're not happy that you're moving away that you moved on you closed out a cycle um, New York could be significant to somebody, Philadelphia also could be significant to somebody as well, and somebody's first, middle, or last name could possibly be Allen, because it, this is the Eager Allen Poe deck, so it could be your, like, your name could be Allen, first, middle, or last, or somebody, you know, that you're dealing with in the collective, I mean, like, uh, either in the collective or, you know, a department could possibly be, have the name Allen, somewhere in there. The magician, your magician, your manifesting, um, is like your manifestations are through the roof right now. You're manifesting like a mofo, so keep doing it. Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit, angels, ancestors, and loved ones. So you're manifesting, moving on, moving forward, okay? And progressing and everything. Spirit, Holy Spirit, angels, ancestors, thank you, Spirit. We got the eight of, um, this is eight of pentacles, reversed. Okay, so they didn't want you working hard. They didn't want you, like that like people didn't want you to be working like they were probably trying to attach your work whatever you do for work um that's not happening you're moving on you're moving forward but i'm strongly getting that because they didn't want you to be able to provide for yourself they didn't want you to be able to move on because they're holding on to you because it should be to this person from your past or no this is two pentacles um yeah they're you're balancing everything out but they didn't want you to be able to do that that's why they're attacking your money your finances and whatnot okay but that's and also i'm getting your days of hard work like is over you worked hard enough god's going to be blessing you to the point where you don't you're not going to have to you know work you know that you've worked hard enough your whole life pretty much is what i'm getting at so you're going to have a reason to to you know to come to to celebrate and shit so we got the ace of pentacles in the reverse Hmm. Let me get more cards here for you. We have the two cups in the, in the bottom of the deck. Alright, we got the three of wands, followed by the page of cups, and the nine of pentacles. Somebody tried stealing an ace. Like, they knew you're getting gifted this blessing from God, this new be passion to be getting with money. Three of wands. Okay, this is like, you're just waiting for your shipments to come in. They're coming. Don't you worry. It's funny. You're going to get a love offer. Um, you're going to be getting, like a, solid, like, a love offer. Somebody that's loyal. And we got the nine of pentacles. Like, all your finances are, like, perfectly, right. it, like, in order. They are right. secure. They're safe. They're secure. There's nothing that nobody can do because it's a gift from God. Yeah, somebody, I'm strongly getting with this ace and uh, pentacles in the reverse, the, you know, the, in reverse. Somebody tried stealing, especially with the eight of pentacles in the reverse right here, too. They didn't want you working hard because they didn't want you getting this ace of pentacles. They could have stole, tried to steal this from you. It's not going to happen because your ships are coming and you're just waiting for them to come in. But they're coming. They're definitely coming. And you're going to be getting an offer. And I'm strongly getting this like a, with the page. It could be somebody being childish but no this is this word could also be talking about a loyal you know if somebody wants to come in with a message to you like you know a love message a love offer but it's a loyal one that's what i'm getting from this one all right 
and the nine of pentacles all your finances are secure they're safe we have the six of wands at the bottom of the deck this is talk about victory success like public recognition um could even be fame okay so whatever you're doing keep doing it we got the page of swords somebody's spying yeah somebody's spying on your your ships that are coming in and this love offer too as well that's coming in for you we got the page of swords here and it's the person that's trying to stop you, that tried to stop all of your hard work, that didn't want you to move on. It's your ex, for sure. And we got the Eight of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Your ships are coming in super fast, dude. And you're also going to be getting a message, too, of truth and clarity as well. I'm getting with this uh, page of, with the, with the, I mean, the, uh, yeah, the page of swords. And it's going to come in fast, like super fast, okay? Holy Spirit, um, just keep doing whatever you're doing. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, angels, the ancestors, and loved ones that passed away. What is the color of the more? What do they need to be aware of? Somebody's got caught spying on your Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, angels, the ancestors, and loved ones that passed away. What is the color of the more? What is this? Thank you. Yeah, we got the Eight of Cups here. Alright, so you walked away from this person that's spying on you. And yeah, they have something to do with this. They did not, they either stole something from you. I'm going to wait and see what other cards come out. Or they were trying to stop you from getting this Ace of Pentacles right here. Which they're not going to be able to because it's a gift from God. Any Aces are gifts from God's, okay? It's from God's hand himself. So they can't take this, alright? Like God's making sure you're getting this. But you did the good thing by walking away from this person. Just look at the way he's standing there. Like he just looks like he's... He thinks he's the shit, and, like, he's had your heart in his hand, like, oh, look, I've read the collector's heart, or ripped your heart out, no, you fucking didn't, like, where were you, you're mad that you, you're, they're mad, because, you know, yeah, they did rip our heart out at one point, right, but they didn't think you could, um, over, like, you'd be able to get over this, or, or be able to go on, they're shocked now, because they see that you moved on, that you walked away, and you want absolutely nothing to fucking do with these people, we got the, um, the ten of ravens, um, at the bottom of the deck, which is the ten of cups, this is talking about, what do you call it like your happy home it could be somebody in your family as well but i'm strongly getting this love offer that you're gonna get you're gonna be coming you know getting is going to be like the message of love or whatever it's gonna be like end up giving you like making you into this kind of um cups where you're gonna have this happy loving home okay holy spirit divine spirit angels ancestors and loved ones that passed away what does this collective need to know what do they need to be aware of all right we have the knight of uh cups right here you're somebody is yeah, so it's your solid love offer it's coming in i'm telling you they want to come in there they want to come in steady too like with a solid offer all right they see what you're doing they like what's going on like what you got going on you're very authentic you're very true um i just heard yellow is true to yourself you know when i just said that uh the ace of cups this is your this is going to be your you know happy copy like the 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 ravens are the cups so it's going to be just picture the cup here instead of a skull your cup's going to be overflowing with love okay and they can't take this it's a solid love offer like it's your divine counterpart that's going to be coming in and you had to lose this fucking weirdo okay you had to walk away from this weirdo so you can get this you know divine counterpart which you're going to get and it's coming in it's right you're just waiting on it it's right underneath this, the three of wands it's coming in Thank you. The Six of Swords. Yeah, you're moving away. Possibly, definitely with this one. Absolutely. You're going to be moving in with this person or moving away with this person. You're going to be like, you know, because it's underneath the page. This is the same energy. Okay? This is the same person. They want to come in with a message of love with you. But they want to come in with a, with a solid offer. They want to move. Maybe they're going to make an offer to you to move in with them. I'm strongly getting that. Yeah, we have the Five of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Now, this person in your past, they feel like they're left out in the cold. They, um, of course, they're just people who, mm -mm, what do you mean? What do you mean, collective things going on and, you know, going on with their actually divine counterpart? Um, but I'm their DM, too. I'm their DF, too. Yeah, the, the, the fucking demonic, uh, this is the demonic one. The demonic masculine, demonic feminine. Get the fuck out of here. You walked away from them. You did the best thing you could have done. Now you can have your actual true, you know, divine counterpart. Your divine masculine, divine feminine. And you're going to be moving with them. Thank you, spirit. 
we have the three of pentacles they want to work together with you too that's beautiful they want to move with you and they want to work with you like in with with your finance like you know maybe like actually work with you you know as well yeah i don't know what you do for work but they maybe they want to help you get like on your feet they they see what you're doing they like it and they want to they want to um what do you call it? invest in you work together with you we got the devil at the bottom they're obsessed with this your ex is obsessed with this and obsessed with you more in the reverse all right so what i'm getting with this is this person is a is a um a, a fallen angel like a dark angel they're definitely working with the dark you know it's like a dark angel like they fell but they see that you are this beautiful and you know you're a beautiful angel you've been very patient this whole time so now with this you know the temperance gives me also the um it, it's patience so um it's giving me like you're not gonna have to be patient no more this is coming in like super it is it's coming in super fast this is beautiful, guys. And now they're finally, this person is finally seeing who you truly are. Uh, you are this angel, okay? And this is definitely given, like, if this is, like, well, I'll just wait until I say that. You're, um, queen of Cups, this, your person, this knight right here, sees you as their Queen of Cups. They want everything with you. They see how loving, nurturing, beautiful inside and out you are, how good of a person you are, how good of a parent you are. If you have any children, you don't have to. But um, they see, like, you're just a... a genuine good-hearted person and they see you as their queen of clubs what does the collective need to know what do they need to be aware about at this time please and thank you thank you spirit we got the three of swords right here Yeah, this per last person that you walked away from, like, they caused you a lot of emotional pain in the past. Like, I'm talking a lot. Like, look, he's holding your heart right there. He ripped that out of your chest, caused you a lot of, he or she caused you a lot of pain. It's really, you know, and, and they did it, like, purposely. Like, just look how smug he's standing there. Looking all fucking smug and shit. Like, ha, I got the collective's heart. Yeah, fuck you, bitch. How about you struck a dick or three? Um, yeah, well, your those days, you walked away from this. Okay, these days are over. You're not going to do this no more. They were actually paid a lot. Of, oh, shit, I see what this is. They were paid to come in to fucking hurt you. They were paid a lot of money, too, to do this to you. And to come in, try to steal your heart, and then walk away and cause you all this emotional fucking horrible heartache. It's being exposed, though. And now that you walked away, could they ended up, they see what happened was, they were paid a lot of money to do this to you, okay? And then they were supposed to come in, get you, like, grab you, you know, grab your heart and everything else, and then rip it the fuck out of your chest, and then walk off, right? Well, yeah, well, karma's a bitch. They didn't realize that, that you're a whole earth angel right here, right? Now that you actually walked away, they never thought you were going to walk away from them. You did. You chose to move on. You said, fuck you. I don't want nothing to do with you no more. And now they're sitting there and they're like, God's beating in their head like, you dumb idiot. Look what you did. And look how good this person. This was a gift from God. Like, this was my gift to you. And this is how you chose to treat my angel. Now, like, God and your an and angels and ancestors and the ones that passed away are tormenting this motherfucker with memories of you how good you were and now they realize you truly did walk away you're not coming back and they lost you forever and it's eating this person up alive right now and mainly their ego they're having like a major ego death right now and now they're the ones that are left in this um three of swords we have the queen of pentacles at the bottom of the deck you are going to be in this energy if you're not yet like where all your finances like or see, you're very um, responsible with your money. You're not like you don't go spending it lavishly, like or recklessly. I mean, we got the star. You are the star here. We got the seven of pentacles, followed by oh seven seven.
followed by the Seven of Swords. Okay, so you're going to turn this heartache into this pain, emotional pain and everything. Your person is coming in. They see you as the star. They see how beautiful, genuine, happy, like, and, and great you truly are. And um, you're going to somehow turn this pain and this sorrow that, you know, from the past people, the people in your past, and so, somehow you're going to use this for your advantage. And it's going to, you know, get you into this star energy here. Um, you could really probably most likely like, you know, you could be doing it and possibly get famous. God only knows. Um, then we have seven seven right after the star, which is absolutely go look that angel number up. That's absolutely beautiful. The seven pentacles, whatever seeds you're planting, third confirmation. Whatever seeds you're planting, they're growing lavishly. When I tell you lavishly, like just keep doing it. And you're gonna have many opportunities with the seven of swords. Um, with uh or the, the what do you call it? Yeah, no, sorry, it's the seven of swords. <laughs> the seven swords, they tried to steal this from you. They tried to steal whatever like seeds you've been planting. Um and yeah that's not happening like they try to steal your ideas your creativity uh they i mean they try to steal pretty much like your destiny but that's not happening i mean you whatever seeds you're growing they're like i told you from the beginning they're coming up against your they didn't want like what you know they didn't want your fucking you to be able to you know you work hard or anything else they didn't want you to do that so they're also attacking whatever they were trying to steal and attack whatever you plant the seeds you're planting all right because that's just, you know, that's what the Seven Swords is, a thievery. Like, they're, they're trying to steal, like, and they're being very deceitful. They're, and they're trying, they actually, they group up with people as well to, to come against you, to steal something from you. It could be this Ace of Pentacles right here. It could be just, like, your hard work and maybe try to use it as their own. People are fucking assholes. And it, whatever you, you would, you know, with the Nine of Pentacles right here, absolutely, they grouped up against people as well to, to, you know, get your, but you, they didn't realize your finances and everything are protected by God. They can't, they can't do that. It's being exposed. But your person that's coming in sees you as this beautiful star that you are, and they see, they know what you've been through. Oh, shit. We got the Four of Wands. This is talking about like your home your like your your like your person wants to come in like this was definitely a person from your past like i mean your ex purse this is definitely 100 percent your ex okay now this is the four ones you're you walked away you're going to be able to move on and have like you know your your stable your stability and that's another thing they're losing their stability now they're losing everything because they came up against you and your person wants to come in with this love offer and you know you're going to be moving forward with them and you know having like a stable you're you're a stable foundation with this beautiful person because you chose to walk away from this person this evil narcissistic you know egotistical piece of shit they didn't deserve you because you're the high priestess you're very intuitive you're very um spiritually gifted uh you're a spiritual leader and you use your gifts very uh very wisely and you help a lot of people with your gifts oh, spirit, my spirit, my spirit, my thank you spirit yeah, we got the Queen of Pentacles. This is like what I said, you're going to be, like, your person sees you as this Queen of Pentacles. Even if you don't feel like you're in that energy right now, you're just waiting for your ships to come in. When your ships come in, they're, you're going to be in this beautiful, you know, when your ships come in, which is going to be this Ace of Pentacles that they tried stealing, that's coming back to you because you walked away from this fool. This was a narcissist that you had to get rid of. God couldn't bless you until you got rid of him or her, we'll just say. But, like, just with the, the sex that are out here, that's what I'm saying, him. But you could just flip the roles where they go, okay? But, um, once you you lost this person, God couldn't bless you with this Ace of Pentacles. This is the person that was holding you back. Because God knew this person was only there for your money and to destroy you, okay? That's all they were doing was to destroy you. They wanted to steal from you. They didn't love you. They didn't care about you. They didn't realize what they had until you, you know, completely left and... Like, now they realize that you're a whole earth angel over here, and you were their gift from God. Now they're, they're moving out. Now that you've got rid of this weirdo, now God can gift you and bless you with, you know, what he has in store for you, what he's protected for you, and it's coming in. Now you're just waiting for it. And when, look, you're even standing there with your hand out at the three months, like, uh, okay, Dad, I'm ready. I got rid of him. I'm ready. Can I have my ships now? And God said, yes, absolutely, yes, you can. So you're going to, you know. You're not going to have to be patient much longer because God's blessing you is coming in quick. Thank you, Spirit. The chariot. You're moving with them. I'm telling you, you're moving with, you're moving with this person. You're, you're going to end up moving in with this uh, 
with this love of yours. They see you. They they see you. They like this is him right here too. He's like, look, I see you, babe. Come with me. You're my everything. I see what you've been through. I see what you're doing. I see how beautiful of a person you are. I see you are you are in you know you're my you're my star. You're my earth angel. Get in this chariot and come ride away with me. He's gonna be like your knight in shining armor right here, like actually a real true one. Queen of Cups, because again, he sees you as his Queen of Cups, or she, right, you know, you know, flip the rules where they go. Because look, the chariot over top of your deck, we're moving it to the, the chariot over top of the six of um, uh, swords, right next to, you know, your knight and shine. I'm telling you, that's what's happening. That's beautiful. Holy Spirit, divine spirit, angels. Um... We do got the two of cups in a reverse. I feel strongly feel that it's supposed to be in the upright, but it came out that way. But um, it's going to be you're coming into union. You're coming into union. The people try to stop this. It's not happening. You're you're coming into union with them. All right. That's definitely it's definitely supposed to be. Yeah, I'm saying it's definitely supposed to be in the upright. But like that was confirmation right there. Yeah, I'm called to put that in the upright. You're coming into union with this person. Okay. And that was just a double confirmation right there. Yeah, the world, okay, there's a whole complete ending to this narcissist and people doing you dirty, stabbing you in the back, robbing you and doing all this evil shit. You were able to complete that cycle and end it. And since you did, you know, your wishes are being granted. You're getting your true um, divine counterpart and you're moving on. You're moving forward with them. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, angels, angels, your loved ones have passed away. And what does the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware about at this time? Excuse me, guys. Yeah, they might have caused um, hiccups for you in the past. Uh, well, they thought they did. Little did they know it was all part of a divine plan. Um, there was more reason behind it. So they're just losers. We're going down. We got the five of ones at the bottom of the deck. They're all fighting about your union, about you moving on. And you, like, you know, because... Oh, what do you mean, collective moving away? Oh, you mean I can't, I can't abuse him no more? I can't him or her anymore? You, what do you mean? Like I'm not gonna be able to, you know, just shit all over them and like, no, take their kindness for weakness anymore? Absolutely fucking not. You weirdos. Queen of Swords, yeah, your ex knows. They know you're the Queen of Swords to them. They're like, all right, motherfucker, you want to look how this landed too. And it's so funny. The um, right on top of the page, like, oh, you're just a page pussy. Well, guess what? I'm the fucking queen. And now I got your heart. Now stay the fuck away from me, girls. I have your juggler too. He thought he was real cocky, but she looks more of a G on that fucking crown. I mean, on that throne with her crown. Do you have a crown, sir? No, you don't. Confirmation. Okay, so yeah, he thought he was playing you. In the long run, he got played, or vice versa. You, just, you know, put the roles where where they fit. We got the Queen of Wands at the bottom of the deck too. This is you. You're very fertile. I mean, you're very um, you're powerful. You got uh, you know, you're very strong. You're very powerful. You're um, you you have power, and they see that. They see that you you're the one with the power, not them. They thought this whole time they had the power. That they thought they can control you. No, you're the one with the power. You're the one that walked away. You're the one that said I had enough. And you know what? You want to take uh, a piece of my heart? How about I take your whole fucking heart? Go go away from me. And they can't recover from this either. Because they never had nobody. Because it's like one of those like, stupid egotistical like narcissistic people that are so full of, them, of themselves. And nobody has told them no before. And they're like, what do you mean? What do you mean you're walking away from me? Like, nobody's told me no. What, what do you mean? Like, you, you don't want me? You should feel honored to be with me. What? No, you're the one that should be honored. You should feel honored to ever even been in presence of this earth angel. All right? You evil piece of blood because you do, like, witchcraft. You do spells and stuff like that to cast over people and love spells and shit. Yeah, guess what? You broke that love spell. And in doing so, you ended up taking his heart confirmation. Holy Spirit. Because you, you're never, like, it was all a fucking love spell that they, they had on there. It shows you how much stronger you are to uh, um than them if like they had a love spell on you and the only reason why you're with them was because of a fucking love spell you broke that love spell and you broke not only that you you end up taking their fucking heart out and look how cocky she is like that too like uh -huh, because you should be you deserve to be after what they put you through. Queen of Wands, you got the you got the power. 
You're the ones with the power. Look. Nine of swords. They're in their head about this. Two of wands. They, they can't sleep at night. They're in their head. They're just torturing them that you moved on. Okay? That you moved on and you're, you're about to have a whole brand new passionate world with this new person. With your person. This is all surrounded by your new person. This whole, you know, spread is all about your love offer coming in. Your genuine divine counterpart. And you're going to have the whole world in your hands with this two of wands right here with your new person. They can't. Like, and everything that you're working on is flourishing beautifully. Beautifully. And it's protected. Heavily protected. And you're going to have this whole new world with not this person with this person right here your divine counterpart whom you're coming into union with you're going to be moving in with you know and they can't sleep at night about this earth they're in pain they're in agony like wow crime near river we got the king of swords at the bottom of the deck and your your person coming in they're they're protecting you this is also archangel michael right here as well but your person right here like they're ready to fight a motherfucker for you too they don't give a fuck you know but you won't have to. You are very heavily protected by Archangel Michael, by God, and, you know, your whole spirit team. Your new beginnings are protected as well. What is the outcome of this situation? We got to ten of, um, the ten of cups in the reverse. Somebody from your past, like your family, alright? This is like, um, karmic family. Yeah, people is ex family and some of do with a house. Hmm. And you're the queen of swords against these people. So they probably teamed up with like, you know, your old family members that like you cut off, um, that to go up against you. Obviously they we want they partnered up with them to go against you. Well, you're now the queen of swords to them. You're the one that holds the power of all this. And it has something to do with money as well. Probably this ace penalties that they tried to steal from you. Alright? And it has to do with a house. Like, something about a house. With your, your karmic family. Or people that you consider to be your family. Alright? They don't want you to have, like, this, you know, the ten of cups in the upright. But you're getting that with your person. Alright? Yeah, and if this is a karmic family that came, that was partnering up with them to, to try to come against you and your union, but that's not happening. You got the king of wands at the bottom of the deck, they're being watched by the cops, and it's like the police right here, somebody with power, somebody like authority, and it's the cops watching them, watching everything that they do, and everything they have done. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, angels, angels, love them the best way, what is it? Yeah, they've been caught just like I caught that card. I'm not going to take them because they didn't, I don't think they're supposed to come out, but there's, there's something at least done. I'm going to place two cards there so two people can have for it. Yeah, King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles. This person coming in is in like a King of Pentacles energy because it's right over top of him. The Five of Cups by the Ace um, of Swords. Okay, so. This is your karmic family. Five of cups. Alright, no, this is your I'm, I'm strong. Yeah, this it's in the upright. So this is it's right over top of your, your love offer coming in. So they're just very stable, they're very um they're very reliable, they're very they they, they they're they're very responsible. So what you know, what I was looking for. Now the five of cups talk about grief, pain, agony. These people in the past are in a lot of grief, pain, and agony from all of this shit. That, like, you know, you're moving on. Them having to release what it, they, they, you know, release you and what, you know, belongs to you that they tried stealing from you. Alright? You're protected. It's the Ace of Swords. Everything I said was the truth. The Ace of Swords truth. And your whole, everything is protected. You are protected. And your God's going to also gift you with more wisdom, more truth, more clarity. But not, not just, and more. It's going to be the Ace of Swords truth, clarity. You're going to, everything that these karmic people have done against you. It's, you're having truth and clarity over it. It's all exposed. They're going to fuck down. Alright? Let me get one more. I'm just going one more. Spirit. I get one more for the alcohol. And you're like everything in your life is protected, okay? Everything. You were protected by God, by angels, ancestors, one that passed away. Do you want any more to come out? One more? One more spirit? Uh, one more for the alcohol. Okay, okay, there's more than one. Alright. They're caught. 
you're the high priestess all right you're very intuitive you're you're a high, your spiritual leader your person sees you as this as well um oh danny they're definitely called. we got the king the king of wands with the um hangman this is the cops they're caught that this is the co oh i didn't realize there's another a card in there there's a knight of um there's a knight of pentacles so somebody wants to come in with some information about solid information about money probably whatever it was that they tried stealing from you okay well this is i'm getting this is like a, the authorities as well like they're this knight going to come in with this authority figure which is probably this king of wands right here who's been watching them they're going to tell you about this money that was stolen from you and that they've been caught they're they're stuck they're in prison they're going or they're going to jail because whatever they stole from you all right so don't worry, everything's going to be golden. You're getting your union. Um, you're getting back whatever was stolen from you. And this ex of yours could really could just go rot in prison because they should never came up against you. They should have never did you dirty. They really took a lot of pride in hurting you and um, pulling your heart out. And now they're like all upset and boo -hoo because now, you know, you actually truly walked away. They thought that you were going to be a revolving door. They thought that they can always come, you know what I mean, leech in their way. Just like this, they just look at them like, oh, I can always come back for collective whenever I want to. They're probably playing in the graveyard. They could be doing graveyard fucking, um magic and shit whatever weird shit these people be doing judgments here though don't worry you're gucci you're golden yeah that's what i'm trying to get but everything's good you're you're fine um spirits tell me not to look more into the deck that that's this this is it right here so i don't know until ne next time just remember god loves you so do i so does your angels ancestors and loved ones that passed away do not forget to give um the utmost uh, thanks gratitude love and respect to to god and angels and ancestors all that passed away because they're moving mountains for you and they're about to rain miracles down on you all right just hang in there a little bit longer you don't have to be much more patient because you've been very patient it's coming in super fast it's coming real real fast all right so just get ready because um this is you know it's your time it's your time to shine you are the star all right and you deserve everything you're gonna get and they deserve everything they get you're you know just so happens thank god you're the earth angel you're you're getting you know, everything you're getting is great what these people are getting is absolutely not good at all it's a prison cell they're going to prison okay they should never you know came against you you shouldn't be doing this to people now they, they're gonna learn the hard way but oh well yeah all right until next time remember god loves you so do i and so does your angels and ancestors love ones that pass away spread love not hate always and please hit the like button please hit share please hit subscribe so you can always be updated whenever i put another message out there for you guys and if you'd like to donate you do not have to it is not a requirement but it is truly appreciated the information is in the description box down below to anybody who chooses to do so thank you from the bottom up with all of my heart ahead of time may god bless your beautiful souls tenfold even just for the likes comments shares and subscribes um all right yes have a good day remember you're fucking amazing you are lovable you are loved you deserve love and love is what you're gonna get and you're not gonna get just any kind of love you're going to get your true divine counterpart and you're moving with them you're moving forward you're progressing with them and you're moving with them like i'm telling you right now you're going to be moving into a house with them so get ready you're going to have like you know your whole happy house everything that these idiots tried to stop from you you're giving